from Fritzing Headquarters in Berlin. This is Fritzing Killer Tips with your host, Stefan Hermann. <laughs> Yes, welcome to the second episode of Fritzing Killer Tips. Today I would like to show you how you can rotate parts and how you can add bend points to wires. So let's say we will build something with a Superflux RGB LED, which we can find in the parts library. So here is one. They, are, uh, they have this uh, rectangular shape. And I would like to use a Superflux LED with a common anode and with and an RGB LED, so like here. If I zoom in in that part, then you can see that the pins have got these little colors. So the pin without any color is a common anode and the other pins are green, blue and red, like they are marked here. If you hover on the pins, then there will always appear this little info box. Okay, but that's not why we're here. Um, if I would like to rotate this part, then I uh, have the option to go to this rotate menu and to say, okay, I would like to rotate it in 45 degrees. But now you can even select the part and go on over a corner and then you can drag your mouse and the part will rotate nicely. So while rotating, Fritzing tries to snap in 45 degree angles, uh, but if you release in another angle, it will stop there. So on this flux RGB LED, it's needed to rotate it a little bit that I have uh, different rows on a breadboard for it. So like this here. That was a tip from Justin McLean, thanks for that, by the way. Okay, and now I can see my common anode is here. This is what I have to connect with my Arduino on the 5V Plus. So I go to the microcontrollers and take out an Arduino. So here that's the latest version, the Arduino Uno R3, which came with additional pins, which we maybe can discuss later or the next time. So, and now I start with placing a wire from here to the 5V plus and I will change the color by right click and say this is a plus so it should be red. And now if I drag and drop the wire or if I drag the wire, if I click into the wire, there will a bend point appear. And if I now hold down the shift key, it will snap in 90 degree angle so now I have a very nice 90 degree angle here and now I, I will place a resistor and I will rotate it here and my LED needs three resistors so I can duplicate them by pressing command D on a Mac or uh, control key on a PC and now I can just take wires down here and I will change the color to let's say yellow. So now you have a very clear design and you can see how the circuit looks like. And that's all for today. I wish you all a Merry Christmas if you celebrate or not and I hope you have a nice time. Bye!